Christian Brothers College defeated Arts Coleridge 48-12 in the semi-final of the Clayton Hotel's Munster School Senior Cup at Irish Independent Park. CBC took an early lead after pressure from the kickoff, with centre Harry O'Reardon touching down out wide in the second minute. The Cork School continued their dominance, and it wasn't long before number 8 Keane Hurley made his way over from close range. Fullback Billy Kane added the conversion. On the 10 minute mark, O'Reardon claimed his second try. After weaving through the defence to go over under the sticks, Kane secured the extras. Arts Coleridge found themselves in the CBC 22 after a sustained period of pressure and were rewarded with the scrum meters out. Scrum half Ian Leonard found Daniel Okeke on a looping charge as the number 8 crashed over. CBC soon responded with the forwards making good ground before the ball was fed along the back line and it was Aaron Lee who dotted down in the left corner. Arts Coleridge fought their way back once more, an impressive run from Daniel Okeke setting the platform for prop Alex Long to barge his way over. CBC's Kane found himself at the end of a slick passage of play from the backs to score his side's fifth try in the match before converting his own try. A period of possession for Ardskull after the interval resulted in another scoring opportunity for CBC, who took full advantage of a long-range penalty from the boot of Kane. Replacement Dylan McAuliffe then secured another try for CBC, crashing over with the help of a driving maul. Kane landed the conversion. A loose ball resulted in a CBC pickup and charge forward. Out half Kean Rooley stepped the defence to record his side's seventh try of the game. Rooley converted his own try. Full-time score, Christian Brothers College 48, Arts Coleridge 12. Presentation Brothers College edged out Bandon Grammar School 19 points to 18 in the semi-final of the Clayton Hotel's Munster School Senior Cup. TBC opened the scoring on the 8th minute, which saw the ball move to full-back Mark McLaughlin, who provided the pass for Peter Cunningham. The press centre collected the ball and went over right of the posts, before Captain Louis Bruce added the conversion. Bandon Grammar responded minutes later, with Captain Jack Crowley stepping up to secure a penalty. Minutes before the break, Bandon unleashed Soren Minahan through the middle, Crowley finding the fullback who ran a fantastic line from halfway to power over and take the lead. Crowley pushed Bandon further in front with a penalty after 53 minutes. Prez replacement Michael Hand then collected a loose ball to race down the right flank and touched down to take a one point lead in the closing stages. Bandon reacted almost immediately after securing the ball from the scrum and it was prop Connor Heaney who barged over to claim the lead once more. Crowley added the extras on the 67th minute. The Prez found themselves deep inside the 22, with the forwards edging ever closer. And it was number 8 Alex Candelan who crashed over before Bruce added the winning conversion on the 70th minute. Presentation Brothers College will now meet local rival Christian Brothers College in an all-cork final at Irish Independent Park on Sunday the 17th of March. Kick-off 4pm. <laughs>